Hi, um, just a short video to tell you the latest update on Enrichment Week this summer from the 10th to the 14th of July. Obviously, we've had a few issues in regards to trying to plan for this summer based around transport costs and various other issues to do with uh, trying to get the places we want to go to, which is a shame. But we've done our best to get uh, what is, I think, a reasonable options for our students. So as you can see here, there are kind of three pathways. The art department have managed to get themselves a trip to Manchester and Liverpool, which is already booked and planned and has 30 students on it. We're looking to have a PE trip to Rock UK. Obviously, the PE department was hoping to go to Spain, but we're unable to get the, the transport and the cost to the right level to allow us to be able to do that. So they have planned for 50 students to go to there in Scotland, uh, if that's possible. And then we have various enrichments within school, which either link to curriculum areas or student choices. So as far as PE department is concerned, they want to go to Rock UK. That's uh, up in the in the Scottish borders. They've used it before. They've uh, It's been uh, superb for the students and they would do that for the five days from the 10th to the 14th. The cost of the trips around £400 and within that they'll be doing all sorts of things including um, mountain biking, canoeing, fencing, all sorts of different activities. If you want to have a look at some of the of the opportunities that are available there, the links that are provided on this slide are available for you so you can see a little bit more detail. There'll be a letter which is also in this class charts announcement which can give you a little bit more detail too. Or if you've got any questions you can ask Mrs Slane in the PE department. So you can see there the various options. If they're not doing the art trip or the PE trip, they'll be in school and they'll be doing enrichments there. There's a range there too to choose from. As you can see here, there's 10 different options of which our students should pick three and a reserve. Okay, so there'll be a form to do that on. You can see there there's various practical exercise like technology and food, enterprise linked to business. There are a couple who which are could potentially have costs due to travel and various other things, such as fishing with Mr. Lobin or the conservation trips with Mr. Lamb. But basically, hopefully, there's enough range there for people to be able to make a good choice about what they'll do. So what the students should do is look on class charts and within their homework, they'll find this form where they've got to complete. Uh, if they're going on the art trip, they say yes, and then they submit the form. If not, they say if they're interested in going on the sports trip, but they would still complete the different options just in case there's too many students who want to go on the sports trip. OK, and then therefore you click on the form, do your different options, make sure you put a reserve in and then we can work out the logistics. I hope that makes sense and it's clear. If you're not if you're uncertain, please email it to me at school. It's Mr. Ward. Thank you very much.